Yeah, but like it was fully like all like fully all this down in the clouds. Oh, I should have saw that. Spent the night camped at Dogman's Hut camping area on the banks of the Murray River in Tom Grogan. To get across the river you do need a four-wheel drive, but you can access the New South Wales side of the river with a two-wheel drive. It is free to camp on the Victorian side of the Murray River, but on the New South Wales side you do have to pay a daily Kosciuszko National Parks Pass fee. Now you can only get across the river to access all these four wheel drive tracks during the summer months. I think it's roughly from June to November every year, this whole area is closed up. There are a few different four wheel drive tracks that leave the Tom Grogan area heading for the Victorian high country. The Davies Plain track was currently closed. We've done the Tom Grogan track before, so our plan today was to tackle the Mount Pinaba track. where we're going, Mount Pinabar. Tom Grogan track straight ahead. Mount and Mount Pinabar that way. Mount Stupid Bar.
when you finally emerge from the bush, you're greeted with some pretty spectacular views as you make your way along the ridge line to the top of Mount Pinnabar. Made it to the top of Mount Pinnabar. What do you reckon of the view, Kai? Wow, it's a little bit windy. Pretty spectacular spot. There's Mount Kosciuszko out over there where we were yesterday. And Tom Grogan, the came frogs down in the valley there somewhere. And we're heading that way into the high country, all out there. I'd say this track is uh, just as good, if not better, than uh, Blue Rag Range and Billy Goats Bluff. The view up here is just as good as them, even better. You, know, you can see out Mount Kosciuszko and everything. And the track to drive up here is probably a little bit more fun, a bit more challenging. The, the drive up uh, Blue Rag's simple. Billy Goats is uh, good fun, but I think this is a bit better. We've got a little bit of shade here, we're gonna have lunch. There's even a bit of grass here, you could camp if you wanted to. This has been a great start to our Victoria high country trip. This is what you can see now, this is what the high country is like everywhere. Just mountains with tracks across the ridge lines. You can see them out through there everywhere. Came up the Mount Pinnabar track and now we're going to go down the Shady Creek track. If you haven't been to these high country sorts of tracks before, then you really got to get to them. It's just amazing views everywhere. Just all you can see around you is mountain ranges. So cool. We're talking about practice. <laughs> Upper track was quite a steep descent down into the valley, but it was all easy going, nothing too hard.
By the time we made it off Mount Pinabar, it was already just about 5 o'clock, so we decided to set up camp at the Wheelers Creek Hut Campground. It was a nice spot and we had the whole place to ourselves. Yep, sure I did. Hey Dad, do you not can we burn that? Look inside the hut. Wheel is hot. A lot of stuff here. Winch extension strap, tree trunk, tree trunk protector. And dad's shoes, that's old shoes you left here ten years ago. Some tomato sauce, some eggs. Hey dad. There's literally eggs in there. Fire. <laughs> 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 Bring him on a stick. <laughs> I'm, I'm an evil witch. Hey Dad, I found this broom, so I'm super smart. I went like, broom, and I like to be like, it was on a stick. Buy a place. Get it. How do you lock it? Don't know. Put this for the down. Put a couple of flags, make, I mean, not flags, I mean, flies, and um, we're putting them in a poison. So we're trying to kill them so they're not annoying, so, mm. so they're not biting us, because we don't want to be bitten by stupid flies. <laughs> I'm not a good 